Hello and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke! Last episode we got our fourth gym badge! We are halfway there guys! Um, we actually also got a new member to our team. We took Naomi out just for, for a while. And put Sammy in the team. This is our Electivire, man. Look at him. He's awesome. He's got some good stats, I think, I'm sure. I mean, look at that attack stat. You can't go wrong. And he's got some awesome thundery moves. So, we're super excited to use him. So excited that we've moved him to the very top of the team. We are now in 214. And we're going to battle this person. And then hopefully, or er, go run into the grass and find a new member. Hey, Psychic Wellington. Everybody's name is Wellington. You've got a manky. I can take care of that. Thunderfang! Oh, Sammy, you are awesome. Why the hell did you burn me? That wasn't cool. Remory, Thunderfang! <laughs> Pidgey. Thunderfang! <laughs> yes! Oh, I'm so excited. Now I gotta run back to the center. All right, all right, let's see what's up. What's this is all about? Let's see, let's see. We also got HM Fly, right? What do you want? What do you want? Ooh, a Pokeball. Oh, it's only a Stardust. Ooh, that one has double grass. Let's go with the double grass. Yes. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, let's see. A freaking Raticate. Come on. Well, I don't even want to waste, like, oh, this shockwave. Shouldn't kill it, right? Because I have a high attack, but not a high special. And then maybe we'll paralyze it. Don't die. I mean, not that I want you or anything, but don't die. I can still put you in the PC. Don't die! Ooh! Sammy was just on the roll wanting to get these crits out. Oh, well, you can use Shockwave. That's nothing. Let's throw, let's throw a ball at it, man. Let's just... We'll just put it away, right? It's good to have a backup. We've seen enough of these episodes to know that having a few Pokemon in the PC definitely helps our case. And we caught it! We're gonna name him... I don't know. Let's see the description. Usually the description, like, gives me a name. It whittles its constantly growing fangs by gnawing on hard things. It can chew apart cinder walls! Oh, I had a dog named Cinder. We had to put her down. She was really young. Let's name her Cinder. And it's a girl. It's perfect. You guys ever played Spyro? Well, they had a Spyro... Uh, it was a PlayStation 3 game, I believe. Or 2, and they remade it for the 3, but I played it on the 3. And the Spyro's buddy, it's a female dragon, is named Cinder. And that's why we named our little puppy that. But she ended up getting arthritis and sadly passed away, but... Hey, Horny! What's up, buddy? You had to freaking poison me? That was not cool. Really? Why does everybody have all these status moves? Let's see. Poison. Right there. No. Use. Alright, Sammy. Let's let's be careful next time, bud. I'm gonna avoid most of these trainers because we're kind of we're kind of overleveled. A polytoad would have been cool. I was trying to avoid you. Wellington. Everybody's name is Wellington. It is so far, it has been the majority. That was not super effective. Aren't you a water type? Holy snap. Let's use Zap Cannon. What? Oh, no. Oh, you missed too. Okay, we'll use Shockwave. How is that not effective? I thought you were a... I mean, I know you're a dragon. Uh... Beanbag? We got this. Yeah, we got this psychic. That's right. Beanbag, I love you. Like, I've fallen madly in love with you. That's how cool you are. Whoa, a cheer him! Let's run away! I feel like there should be something right here. There is a good reason that this patch of grass is not there. And we're gonna find out why. But it would let me interact. Oh! I guess I didn't have to go through all that. Why do we have a lot of tags? Okay. Alright, alright, run! Ugh! Should have bought some repels. Oh, I have to battle you, don't I? All right, let me throw a super potion on our on our 
on our Sammy. Now we're ready to fight! Ah ha 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 ha! Marshall! Oh, thank god it's not another. Oh, he. That, that was easy. He scared the hell out of me. I want to go back for that ball, though. Trico, how cool would have that been? Pretty cool. Zen headbutt my butt. Well, please don't Zen headbutt my butt. That would hurt. Kangaskhan! Chuck Weave. Scary face, okay. Thunderfang? Barrage. Nope. 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 Stop it. Quit it. Oh, hit two times. Okay. Ugh. Why do they have to be so scary? And we're so slow. Barrage sounds like a normal type move. Haha, -ha, it was. Wait, that was stupid. Because I... That was dumb. Yeah. Good thing he switched out. He like knew that he couldn't affect me. So he switched out. Because he's like, you're such an idiot for bringing out a... Hey, Nightly leveled up. We're bringing out a ghost type to a normal fight move. Ooh, and you want to learn Shadow Ball? Hell yeah, what's that? Let's see. Special. It may lower the target's special defense. That lands without fail. That's 70 and a high crit. 80. I feel like getting rid of Ominous Wind. Ooh, but it does raise all my stats at once. And I use that a lot. I guess I really don't need this one. Let's get rid of that. We're just gonna have all of the freaking Kangaskhan. Do you think Munchies can take him out? Yeah, he's got like, yeah, he's got a little bit of health left. What is that move? Whipped up a whirlwind. <sighs> really? Come on. That was not cool. I guess we'll use it one more time. Shit. Okay, okay. That was good. That was that that was scary. Kill it! Okay. All I wanna do is go up and get this Pokeball. You don't have to keep encountering me. Thank you. I don't think we have an item that we can put on. We got another quick bell? Quick claw? <laughs> I looked at Soothe Bell and Quick Claw, yeah. Magmarizer. No, no, no. Power lens. Speed step, no. That's terrible. <gasps> Ooh, magnet. Yeah, that's perfect. That was meant to be. Sammy, you were meant to be, my love. Oh. I didn't even have to go this way to get the Pokeball here. I feel like I'm an idiot. Alright, let's... <laughs> that was dumb. Don't encounter anything. We found honey. I worked hard for you. I did not want some honey. Whew! That was one thick cat. Can't escape. Get out of here. There's another ball though! Okay, okay. Tiptoe, tiptoe. Turn it. Asmuriel, let's thunderfang you. We're almost out of PP. A fluffy tail. That just helps me escape battle. Mother trucker! Pergly, you're beautiful! Don't let anybody else tell you that is not the truth. Haha! <laughs> Oh my gosh. <gasps> An Infernape! We're getting out of here. That was scary. Okay, I know I keep hitting it. This looks oddly suspicious. Like, why have this random opening in the fence? I don't know. We don't ask questions. Valor Lake Fe This is another r route? Oh my gosh. Let's see if we can avoid encountering anything. Darn it! <laughs> we were so close! <laughs> what do we got? A gall bat! You know, that's not too bad because, um, Golbat does evolve into Crobat. And I like Crobat. Alright, let's see what we got in here. Let's get lucky. Right, Golbat? Come on. Let's get lucky, boo. We're on a, we're, we're on a roll here. Let's Let's just wiggle wiggle, yeah, right in that ball. Ah, oh, that was awesome. And that gives us some flying type advantages too, man. We have got two awesome people. Poison flying, sweet. That pretty much makes up for horny. 
Its sharp fangs punch through the toughest of hides and have small holes for greedily sucking blood. <laughs> well, we already had Dracula, which was Diglett. We lost him fast. So what should I name you? You are a male. We're gonna name him Vampire and put a little sunshine next to his... His name. It's perfect. And, and the least bit creative, but we did it anyway. Yellow flu. Why are we getting such terrible items? Well, I think that Vampire is gonna stay in the box for a little while. A Pidgeotto sweet. Mainly because... I like our team right now. <laughs> I thought about taking out Munchies or... Jingle Bell, but I have an attachment to both of them and I don't want to switch them out yet. So right now vampires just gonna just gonna hang out. What are you guys doing here? They say there's legendary Pokemon in this lake. I aim to capture it on film like I've done before. It was me who filmed that red Gyarados at Lake of Rage. How cool is that? Referencing back to the second generation. The Pokemon of the lake won't come out if it senses people. We're lying in here to ambush it. That's kinda mean, sir. Where are we? Did we make it to a new town? There's two Pokeballs over there! What am I to do? I've gone and dropped my sweet keys somewhere again. The hotel people won't be happy with me. I'm sure I had it when I left the reception counter. I only had a Pokemon app dowsing machine. Are you hinting at something here? I have one of those. Is it over here somewhere? No. Well now I'm gonna have to hit this annoying button. Just to appease you. I wonder- it's not one of those items, is it? I can't do it while I'm moving. That's... oh, that noise. Seven star restaurant. Uh, that sounds like you want to battle me and I'm not okay with that. I need to find a Pokemon Center! Do they not have one of those here? Or 213. I'd rather be in a pool than the sea. Salted tang of the sea tastes like my tears. <laughs> Hello. Is that Looker? Hi! I'm the game director- Oh! Oh, you're working on filling your Pokedex. I hope you'll come show me your Pokedex when you filled it up more. Sure. That probably won't happen, but... One can dream. I love how half of the city is Valor Lakefront and half is... Route 213. We're gonna explore around here real quick. Hello? Just a simple guy. Let my guitar do all the talking. All I need is music and Pokemon. I can shine. I hear there are guys like me who go around Pokemon centers. Really? Ooh, please read my fortune. A magical encounters in the winds. Though I cannot tell whether it will be a Pokemon or a trainer. Well, I hope it's Pokemon. We're the traveling troupe of street performers. In place of formal introduction, please take this. What? Trick room. Okay, thanks. Doesn't that only work for Porygon? Is it right? You're a traveler? Have you heard of Whirl Islands? Yeah. Silver colored Pokemon. I must see that during my lifetime. You want me to come and show you a Lugia? Well, if I encounter it in the wild, I'll try to remember that you were the one that wanted to see that. What is this? A very Pokemon can scale. What? What? What move is that called? Rock, rock climb, I think, right? Looks like I need it. Huh, you look like you all want a battle. A restaurant you can enjoy more than just exquisite dining. I don't want to. I want a place to heal up. Well, fine. If that's not what you're going to give me, then... Hi. You wish to stay at... Yes! Oh. Oh, thanks, dude. You the bomb. All right. I was kind of disappointed there. The hotel's so romantic. I hope a night on a Pokemon will sweep me away. Well, I have a Nile that was supposed to be night Lee, but that didn't work out. A pink scarf. Well, I guess I'll go back to find the key later. I don't know necessarily what I'm looking for, and I probably have to have that rock climb, so... You look like you want to battle. I don't want to battle you. Hello? <laughs> Ooh, I got past him. <laughs> So we're at a new route, right? We're 213? That's not bad. Hi. 
There's a fancy hotel. And a fancy restaurant. Fancy people. Okay. You didn't want to battle me. I was actually, like, waiting for you to in initiate it and you didn't. Hello, Fisherman Joe. You've got a bell toy that's not gonna be... It doesn't affect it, does it? Man. <gasps> Munchies, no. Let's go with Beatbag. Shockwave, it was not effective. Iron Head was super effective. It wasn't really. Shaman! What are you, a grass type? Man, I really need some new moves. Munchies, let's. No, that was a terrible idea! Why do I keep doing this? I don't think about these things, and why are you level 28? Holy freaking hell! Miley! Frenzy plant. That is such a strong move! What am I gonna do? Ah, he must recharge. I did nothing! Oh, man. Attack. Aha! Quick claw. Oh, we got a critical hit! Yes! That was terrifying! Oh, we got so lucky there. And a Sheldon. Hello, Sheldon. Rock polish, okay. Let's try Shadow Ball. Urgh. One more. One more. Stop that. Thank you. Trying to kill me, you mother trucker. What are you guys doing? Dr. Footsteps House. Hello. Pokemon are quite easy for me to read. I need only see their footprints, and their innermost thoughts are revealed. First, I will determine how it feels about you. Huh, humans can't. Okay. And this is what your lecturer thinks of you. Okay. He must be like a friendship checker. Hello, lady. I can skip all of this if I knew Rock Smash, but I don't want to teach it to nobody. I hate HM so much! And I've already ranted about this, so I won't do it again. But I still hate it. Uh, I guess lazy bones. Because you don't really need. Yeah, we'll just get rid of Psycho. Let's do it. Let's see what's over here. Hopefully, it's worth it. A freaking honey tree! Urgh, that was not worth it at all. Hello. I totally was gonna skip you. I got so disappointed about the freaking honey tree! Whoa! That was my boat. Okay, I'm going too fast again. Let's think. Let's not be dumb. Let's not lose everybody in our team now. We learned this the hard way more than once. Why are you just staring at the wall, my friend? something on top of this big cliff. How am I supposed to climb it? That's a good question. I was asking myself that too. Alright, let's see what our first encounter in 213 is! It is a explode! Shout out to explode! We should not kill it with Thunderfang because it's just a normal type. That's right. Why would you do that, explode? I just wanted to add you to the box of Pokemon waiting to replace one of my dead ones. Not that bad, sir. Wow, we've already made it to Pastorilla City? That was pretty quick. Hello? Stop moving! Stop! <laughs> Footprints are left in the sand. Okay. Do you know about the Battle Frontier? No. I guess just someone who's kind of out of the loop. I hear it's a fun place. Yeah, I'm sure it's a blast. I'm sure there's lots of big, scary, strong Pokemon that I don't want to deal with. See the Great Marsh. I'm studying at or staying at the Lakeside Hotel. This place should have a Poke Center, right? The last one didn't, even though that guy at the hotel healed me up, which was very nice. Oh look, what's this? Aw, oh, how cute. Alright, moving on. Nurse Joy, I need your assistance. Is this one of those guitar guys that one dude was talking about? Come on, let's show off our po do a battle, another battle in here. Uh sure? Your spirit vibes. It is one of those guitar guys! Oh man, that's awesome! Let's get him out! Shockwave! That was easy. I mean... I shouldn't say that, I'll jinx it. 
Great marsh. I wonder what all that's all about. Seawater drains slowly away over time, leaving a huge marshland. That's why they say there are rare Pokemon that you can only see here. Interesting. Let's see what it's all about. There's the gym. Is this where that dude that sings is? Yes. Crash or wake. Oh gosh. <laughs> You'll know what you mean when you challenge him. He sounds crazy. The Great Marsh quick trams on rails are used for transportation. They prevent damage to the Great Marsh's ecosystem. Hello? Hello. He turned his head when I got on this side! Though the name says quick, their movements are anything but. They're the quick trams that transverse- oh. But they're not quick. Hi Psyduck! Were you one of those Psyducks hanging out at, at that other place? Way back in the route when we had Horny still? Well, it looks like- what else do we do here? We gotta- we gotta battle the gym leader, right? Make her smile. Oh, thanks. Another white fluff. I think I have like four of those now. Oh gosh. The package hasn't arrived from the Viastorm warehouse yet. I have to wait here until then. I'm going batty from this wait. Oh man, I wish I could do something that involved lots of explosives. Yep, this is gonna be a smashing job for Team Galactic. That's great. What are you doing? Pastoria's Great Marsh Observatory. Why don't we maybe see what's in here? Howdy, you're playing the Safari game? How would you like to try my game out at the same time? Yep, there's only one. It's real simple. All you have to do is capture five or more Pokemon in one Safari game. And then you get a matchmaker thing. Cool. Well, I can't legally do that. So, but thanks. It's pretty cool. Use a pair of binoculars. You can see what kind of Pokemon can be caught. Oh, really? Tell me I'm not a match. The Great Marsh posts seem to be different from the ones yesterday. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. You know, personally, I never... I had terrible luck with the Savari. I never understood the whole throw... And, and this was in, what, Fire Red and Leaf Green, and then... The next gen. Ruby and Sapphire. Be... Trying to figure out if you need to throw a rock, or throw mud, or throw food, or whatever the options were, was confusing as hell, and I usually just pissed the Pokemon off, and it ran away on me. Tell me what your, like, your experience is with the Savari Zone. Do you, like, know the secrets to, to get all the awesome Pokemon that are in it? Or are you like me and just don't know? A Wobbuffet. A slack off. Oh, we boo. I wonder if these aren't randomized, are they? They couldn't be. They look very normal. I want to see what this one says, though. Shift tree! Maybe it is random. There's two of them. Car Carnivar. Empoleum? Yeah, it's random. <laughs> There's no way that that would be in the normal game. Ludicolo. Looper. Sphew! I do. <gasps> Metagross. We already have one of those. We got the beanbag. That's it! So we can either go to the Safari Zone and catch a new member... ...or go to the gym leader. Well, we might as well just walk into the grass. I mean, what's it gonna hurt? Yeah, I'll play. I can guarantee you he's gonna run away, though. I'm not- like I said, I am not good at this at all. And it doesn't matter what I run into. So let's just- let's just run in some grass. Can you get items here? Is there anything important here? Uh, Carnivine. I mean, that's not a bad. That's at least a, a grass type Pokemon. We don't have one of those. See, what do I do? Should I just throw a ball at it? It's gonna run away and then I'm out of luck. Come on, Carnivine. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. No, did you run away? Watching carefully. Can we try again? Yeah, because if I throw bait. It makes it harder to catch, but more friendly. But if I throw mud, it just scares it off. But it apparently makes it easier to catch. But look at that! Second time's a charm. Sweet! That's not a bad member. I'm thinking about it. I'll think, I'll think about it and see if next episode we actually add him to the team. Because he's a grass-type Pokemon. 
we don't have one of those. And he would come in handy. It binds itself to trees and marshes. It attracts prey with its sweet smelling drool and gulps them down. The bug catcher Pokemon. Well, welcome, welcome, Carnivine. Oh my god, you look like, you look so goofy. Look at his sprite, he looks ridiculous. And that's exactly why they're gonna name him Ridiculous. Ridiculous. <laughs> okay, I think I've been playing this too long. Ridiculous. That's probably spelt wrong, but ridiculous. It look, it looks wrong. <laughs> Awesome guys, well I'm gonna end this up with here. We got some awesome catches and we'll see next episode if we decide to bring Carnivine in. Um, if I knew that the next gym leader was an actual water type, I would say hell yeah, but we don't, it's random. So I appreciate y'all for watching. Go ahead and like and subscribe and I'll see you around next episode.